Good morning, everyone. It's Motivation Monday. I'm Patrick, and today I start a 100-pound weight loss journey. Yeah, I'm on my way to the official weigh-in. I'm six foot four. In 10 days, I turn 50 years old. Uh, a few years ago, I lost over 100 pounds in 41 weeks. And I did it without a meal plan. I didn't have any kind of nutritional strategy or diet that I was on. I ate whatever I wanted. I just increased my activity level, my exercises. Uh, to be on normal levels and just burned it all off. So when I started to cut back to a normal level because I am a working business professional, I, um, I began to put the weight back on. And then I started yo-yo dieting and uh, that just made things worse. So it's taken me about three years, three plus years, but I put it all back on and some. And now I have a laundry list of health problems from hypothyroidism, which is a genetic thing, but it still impacts my weight gain. High cholesterol, my blood pressure is now rising. I've got chronic back pain, fatigue. I've developed sleep apnea. I have poor circulation in my legs. Um, I'm, I'm, my health is, is, is failing. And um, I want to get my health back, my fitness back. So I'm doing something about it. I had a consultation with a dietitian, and now I have a, a nutritionist, uh, dietitian approved meal plan. So I'm real excited about that. I, uh, I have the exercise part of it down. I'm not worried about that. But I've also learned a tremendous amount about little lifestyle changes and how they impact your weight. For example, I had no idea that um, a proper night's sleep can increase your melatonin and help you burn more calories during your sleep and impact your metabolism. On the, on the flip side, if you don't sleep well, cortisol increases, which increases fat storage around your midsection. So if you're overworked, overstressed, um, and most of your food comes from a menu on a drive through uh, restaurant, then you're in the same boat I am. Uh, I am uh, obese, and uh, I have more than 100 pounds to lose, but that's what I'm going to do first, and then we'll assess where I go from there. So I'm putting myself out there. I'm going to document this. I encourage you to follow me. Uh, hopefully I can inspire and help some people. But I need your encouragement. I need your prayers um, to make this happen. And um, I'm doing this for my loving wife, who I want to live and grow old with. I'm doing it for my daughter, who... Hopefully I'll be healthy enough one day to walk her down the aisle. I'm doing this for my son and his beautiful wife that, that I could share in their passion for the sport of fitness. And maybe, maybe one day, the good Lord will bless me with some grandchildren and I can play with them. So um, today is the first day of the rest of my life. People would ask me, how are you doing today? And I would say, better than I deserve. But there's a, a famous financial guy who already coined that phrase, so I won't say that anymore. So when they ask me, how are you doing today, I say, better than I was yesterday. And, uh, and that's going to be my mantra, is to continuously improve every day. And uh, when you continue to develop personally, uh, it affects everything in your life. So if you don't have your health, you have nothing. So I'm gonna get my health back. So won't you come on the journey with me? And uh, I thank you. Have a great day.